An important concern in today's farming is dwindling resources and climate change. Sustainable farming offers solutions for successful farming in this challenging time. Sustainable farming is a blend of traditional and innovative scientific approaches customized to do farming in a successful way. Adoption of sustainable farming system increases value of produce harvested with minimum resource. JP is an integrated holistic sustainable farm service provider. It was started in 1992 by agricultural graduate in Virudhunagar, a prominent agro commodity market in the center of Tamil Nadu. JP Biotics has been adopting innovative technologies for its smart sustainable inputs production and ICT enabled farm extension. JP Biotics produces wide array of smart sustainable inputs for nutrient, pest, disease and stress management. It utilizes selected and well-researched microbes, algae, botanicals and earthworms at its input production center. JP Biotics consistently gets technology and parent culture from Premier Agricultural University TNAU and National Center of Organic Farming for sustainable input production. JP Biotech's organic inputs, wormy compost, microbial biofertilizers, azospiralum, phosphobacter, potash mobilizers, microbial fungicides, trichoderma, pseudomonas, and micronutrient mixtures are recognized for its quality. Now, these inputs are supplied to farming community by State Agriculture and Horticulture Department. My name is Palneshwar. I'm an MS Agriculture graduate. I did my post-graduation in microbiology from TNAU. Uh, in the uh, middle of my graduation, I started my own uh, small uh, microbial uh, unit where we are producing some biofertilizer, biopesticides, and trichodomos, pseudomonas uh, in a small scale level. Uh, two years back, I became an uh, incubator in uh, TNAU under NAP scheme. And since then, uh, uh, when I entered into TNAU, uh, my market has been uh, expanded to uh, various scales and various platforms. If before that time, I was just an input dealer. I was just manufacturing input and uh, just selling an input. And it was a routine business and it was a very small scale operation. Once I've been into a uh, TNA incubation, my, my uh, market has been transformed to another segment where I'm now addressing the very big corporates in food, food safety addressing their food safety norms and food traceability and all these things we are doing. Since we have, uh, have all the inputs to address this food safety, we are basically we are producing some organic inputs. All these organic inputs are uh, addressing the food safety. So now I am uh, able to find that I have, uh, other than selling a product, now I am adding some value to the uh, supply chain. So by creating this uh, value chain, I, I, my, uh, my my opportunities and market has been uh, increasing tremendously. After getting into the TNAU, uh, getting the advice on uh, how to implement a gap, and how to uh, uh, maintain your data and how to uh, streamline your uh, record keeping operation, all these things has helped us a lot into maintaining uh, to grow us. Now we have uh, helping a lot of food processing companies to grow for a uh, gap standards and for uh, European uh, norms. Uh, some other uh, thing we are uh, trying is for a very good food label like a frog, like sustainable labels and all these things we are addressing now. For all these things I uh, must thank the TNAU ABD for uh, uh, giving us a wonderful guidance on how to proceed because it's just from a simple input dealer to uh, mature us into a uh, good player in the providing a service to food processing industry. It is a, uh, I, I just thank uh, TNAU and particularly to director TNAU ABD. Uh, and the NAP scheme first uh, guided us a lot and uh, made us uh, to move to uh, another platform. Apart from addressing sustainability in open field farming, JP Biotechs is also addressing challenges in indoor farming. JP has introduced an organic hydrophonic media and grow bags. This technology makes ease of growing plants indoor in terrace garden and in greenhouse. This technology makes ease for growing plants by women at home.
JP Biotechs is a member of the Directorate of Agribusiness Development of Tamil Nadu Agricultural University. Incubation at TNAU has helped JP Biotechs to access the recent research and try for addressing sustainability in farming. TNAU has been providing technical support in production of newly sustainable inputs and developing smart extension through ICT system. My name is Kunal and I represent Cropin Technology. Uh, at Cropin, we are building state-of-the-art mobile and web-based technology for the agriculture sector. For the last four years, we have been dedicated in building this technology and extending it to most of the multinational corporates working in India. We have worked with more than uh, 20 corporates here with more than 50,000 farmers and helping them in terms of increasing their productivity, helping them in terms of managing their practice, package of practices, utilizing the right inputs into the farm so that they can get the right amount of produce from their, from their plots and get the right quantity. Right now with TNAO we are doing a project with the chili farmers under the guidance of Mr. Palanisha from uh, JP Biotech. The project is mostly to empower the farmers, help them in terms of getting the package of practices right, in terms of enabling capacity building of the farmers and then helping them in increasing their productivity and getting into the crops which can give, get them the global standards. At Cropin Technology, we are building the state-of-the-art mobile technology. The mobile technology is given, basically given to the field team. The field team can carry this device to the remote farms and monitor the farms effectively. The device helps them in multiple ways. The first thing that the device does is it helps in terms of monitoring the area of the farm. It, the field team has, has to just go around the farm, capture the information and the application gives the exact area of the farm. Based on this area, the, the field force can actually help the farmer in terms of guiding them what input to be used at what time for the particular crop. The next thing important for this is it helps you in terms of advisory where the farmer can, can raise an issue and the field team can go to the farms. They can capture the pictures of the issues, they can capture the voice of the farmer, they can capture what is their issues to their observations, what actions has been taken and they can submit this information. Once the information is submitted, it directly comes into the servers where the central team can look into the problem faced by the farmer and advise it effectively. The advice can be sent over from the web application through multilingual SMSs which can go to the farmers directly. The, the other part which is very important is we load the entire package of practice for the crop into the system and that package of practices gets self-loaded for the field team to go and monitor and advise the farmers. For a chili crop, the usage of fertilizers, pesticides are very important and we ensure that the right practices, the right inputs are going to the farms so the right quality and the right quantity is coming out which can be exported, which can be traced from anywhere across the globe back to the farms. That was is the mobile technology. On the website, whenever the field team is capturing any, any information, it's come to the web application and the web application does all the algorithms to give you the best results the reports which can be used directly by the managers and the management to effectively manage their business. In the terms of the chili project that we are doing with TNAU, we are having more than 100 to 200 farmers which are directly engaged into the project. We are monitoring them directly through the mobile application and effectively we are helping them in terms of giving them the right advice at the right time. We we assume that with the, with the right technology usage and with the cutting of the costs, and with the reduction in the losses which is which is observed by the farmers we should be increasing the revenue of the farmers by close to 30 to 40 percent and reducing the cost by close to 13 to 15 percent that's what we have observed in the last four years and that's what we want to extend in the coming years we wish jp farms the very best in this future endeavor and we hope that with the technology that we have built we'll get a great success going ahead thank you This innovative mobile-based farm monitoring and traceability system eases the record-keeping system and brings more value to sustainable farming practices. JP Biotechs now provide end-to-end -end solution for food processing companies in their farm-to-fork venture by addressing food safety and food traceability requirements. Yeah, good morning, uh, my name is Jay Singh from Garden Valley Export uh, Corporation, a company that's engaged in uh, export of uh, chilies uh, uh, to European countries and to the US. Uh, there's a growing uh, regulatory uh, uh, requirement for uh, chilies and food products that meet legislative requirements 
uh, where customers want chilies that are within prescribed limits or they want either organic chilies. Uh, due to this increasing demand from our customers and due to their regulatory requirements, uh, we were forced to uh, think about alternatives to meet uh, these requirements of our customers. And uh, we found that uh, JP Biotech uh, has the expertise in organic inputs. So we've uh, engaged with them for the last uh, two years, primarily to uh, teach farmers through a contract farming model on how to uh, grow chilies by using uh, minimum chemical inputs with a focus on organic inputs. So this is an uh, activity that in goes right from seed selection right up to uh, harvest and uh, post-harvest management practices. Uh, with, uh, with JP Butter, we've engaged with more than 3,000 farmers in the villages surrounding uh, Virudhanagar, Chutukurin and uh, Ramnad uh, districts. The efforts have been rewarding and uh, for us as a company, but the real success uh, really comes back to the, the farmers benefit out of the entire activity. Uh, this is just the beginning and we hope that over the years we will be able to share more of these practices uh, through JP Biotech, uh, through our uh, contract farming venture and hopefully farmers benefit from it and we as a company also benefit. Thank you. Having complete tools to address farm challenges, JP Biotech is implementing contract farming service by networking small farms to grow dry chilies and vegetables for exports to international food standards. JP Biotech's persistence in bringing out technology to rural area has been recognized by Government of India by awarding National Award for Excellence. JP Biotech is in its journey of sustaining joy among farmers, is persistent in its pursuit for excellence in bringing research to farmers' field.